fast food retailer Guzman Y Gomez is rapidly expanding across the country and into foreign markets. The Mexican food maker is planning to open more than 25 drive through restaurants next year and scale up its operations in the United States. Since launching in 2006, Guzman y Gomez has been growing quickly. Starting out in the inner Sydney suburb of Newtown, 15 years later, the brand is global. We got over about 150 stores. I mean, the, most of them are in Australia, but we have 15 in Singapore, we got four in Tokyo, and obviously we have our, our first store in Chicago, and all these stores will grow. In, in Australia alone, we'll build 20 to 30 uh, restaurants a year. They're mostly drive throughs Founder Stephen Marks hails from New York, and when he moved to Australia 20 years ago, he realised our Mexican food options were lacking. Well, I think, you know, uh, so when we opened up the first store, I think I underestimated people's knowledge of Mexican food. Man, we had, you know, chefs from Mexico. We were the first ones doing pork shoulders and brisket. But a lot of people didn't know what we were doing. The people that knew what we were doing loved it. So like any entrepreneur, I was losing a lot of money. I opened up a second store. And that was losing out of money, so I opened up a third store. I just wanted people to see that we were growing. Guzman has tapped investors for capital to help the business grow. Right now, we think we can have anywhere between six to 800 restaurants just in Australia. Next year is uh, to open up over 25 drive throughs in Australia. I think we're going to open up 20 in the next six months. The secret to success for Guzman has been the quality of the food and reinvesting profits. I think, think people think that you make money overnight, but GYG just constantly reinvests. And, and you got to build brand. you got to build a product that people love. So I think sometimes when people start a business, they go a little bit in. You know what I mean? I mean, for GYG, we were all in, right? I think you need to have everything on the line to live through those early stages of the business, right? Because then, you, then you're in touch with everything that happens within the business, which is, which is crucial. So for any entrepreneur, man, I mean, do your work. I mean, love your detail. you got to think that you have the best product in the world and make sure you surround yourself with amazing people that'll support you. Edward Boyd, Sky News.